Welcome back everybody, let's play Pokemon Gold, I didn't say Pokemon Green there, um, in the last episode we found a, well we found basically that uh, the soul of Prick has embodied a red haired emo kid, uh, who has become what we call in the game as Prickish. Uh, we've still got one Pokemon of course, the Amazing Seth. Now, the audio is a bit crap, I do admit, from last time round, so bear with me. Hopefully, it's okay now. And a Pokemon battle! Right, I've, I've taken a few days away from uh, playing, um, doing Let's Plays and all that stuff. Um, for certain reasons. Um, commitments on other channels and different things or whatever. Uh, been hanging last yesterday. <laughs> uh, that's about it. Okay, anyway. So, uh, we found out that Prick is back for vengeance. We're gonna take our daily dose of berries. Does the Berry Master give you another one as well? No, no, no. He's just a, he's just a, a moron and just gives you one. Alright. Do, 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 do. Oh, a Pokemon battle! I just lost, so I'm trying to find more Pokemon. Wait, you look weak. Come on, let's battle. Um, I'm the guy who trained Amazing Paris at one point. One that could KO an Alakazam in the face. You know what you're on about, mate. Anyway, so he's got a level 4 Rattata, and if I'm honest, even if I had a level 5 Cyndaquil, I would probably still kick this guy's ass. You know, he's got a, he's got he's gone for a Tail Whip, which is as, as it's a decent move if, it had, if he had like a second Pokemon, but he's only getting it one shot now against me. Uh, which isn't going to do that much. Nope. And we win. With Tackle. And that's Seth. So Seth grows level 9. And we defeated the youngster Joey. Well, maybe it would help if you got more than one Pokemon. Moron. You're next. You're a Pokemon trainer, right? Then you have to battle! What happens if I'm, like, taking my Pokemon to the Pokemon Center, because they're all fainted? I can't really battle you then. Yeah, I'll take on your Pidgey with my FOOT! <laughs> but, you know, there is Pidgey. Uh, we've got Seth, and he's got Tackle, so... We should be able to two-hit this guy. I say should. And we do! You never know about Seth's sometimes terrible accuracy. Uh, Rattata, level four. Another level four. This should two hit, one a uh, three hit. Tail whip, and it didn't work. Am I gonna two hit or three hit this guy? Three. He hits tail whip, but uh, it's it's not gonna help him. Basically, Seth is a uh, one lucky one lucky Cyndaquil right now because he wins. We beat youngster Mikey or Mickey or something. Like that. I think it's Mikey. Hang on. Yeah, it was Mikey. Okay. Let's carry on. This woman's not a trainer, by the way. There you go. I'm not a trainer. But if you look into one's eyes, prepare to battle! Yeah, well, you're not a trainer, so that's good. Ah, oh, this scatty man person. Instead of bug Pokemon, I found a trainer. Yep. Yeah, you get bug trainers from the off as well. So. A little bug guy. Little bug catcher Don. Uh, he's going to sound a canopy. Level 3. Okay. we got Seth, though, so he should be fine. Seth's got tackle. I really should, I think... I don't know if Seth's got another berry on it yet. Guess we're going to find out. No, I'm that stupid. I haven't put a, 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 a new berry on Seth yet. God damn it. Now, canopy's gone. And that should be enough for Seth to level up, and it is. Level 10. Uh, I'm guessing Weedle? Another Caterpie, alright. In this game, you get a chance to catch all 251 Pokemon, but just like Pokemon uh, Red, Blue, and Yellow, some Pokemon are, uh, are color-specific only. Um, in this, I think it's... I think you can only get Caterpies in gold and, and Weedles in silver. So we won't be getting... Uh, we won't be getting B back. Right. This guy's not a trainer either. Now! Pokeball! 
We got an antidote! Okay, now we can go in here. This is the, uh, I think it's Dark Cave. Yeah. And as you can see, it, 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 its name is Suit for Purpose. I can not see a bleeding thing in here. I'm trying to actually get into a Pokemon battle, just to show you what Pokemon you find in here. There you go. You get Geodudes in here, level uh, 2. So yeah, not that good. Uh, we're going to tackle him, because I'm confident about a win here. That didn't do much. But he's going to tackle me, and that did 1 damage. I would go Leer now, but I'm afraid that he's got a defense curl. Anyway, I can two hit knockout. I can two hit this guy now. That's one. There he goes on red. I can catch Geodude if I want to, but I, I, I'm not going to have a Geodude on my team. I know exactly what I'm going to have on my team. And uh, four of those five that I will be getting, I can get quite early. Um. I can get two after I get the first badge. The other two, um, sort of close to the same place. Anyway, we're gonna get this. This is another Pokeball. So that's now a Poke Accent E Balls, as Barry would say. Um, so yeah, we now got six Pokeballs. Right, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna bury up Seth. <laughs> Belly up. <laughs> bury up. Okay, here we go. I caught a bunch of Pokemon. Let me battle with you. This is one of my favorite trainers. This is Bugcatcher Wade. Um, yeah. Just proves how much I like him. I actually know his name. But anyway, Wade's got four Bug Pokemon. And I think he's got two Caterpies and two Weedles. Either he's got three Caterpies and a Weedle, or he's got two... I don't know. He's got something like that. Anyway, he's going to try a String Shot, try and lower my speed. And with me being... Loads of levels above him. I don't know if that's going to work or not, and it, it should, but it doesn't, so yeah. Seth, tackle attack until we can get an elemental move, which is our next stop. We're just going to have to keep using tackle. And we're going to tackle again on Caterpie and knock it straight out in one, in one hit. Aww. Right, next. Caterpie, another Caterpie. Yep, so I guess it's three Caterpies and a Weedle that this guy's got. And it seems like that second canopy was a physical defense moron. Uh, come on, Seth. Wow, what HP critical hit! Seriously? Uh, Seth's a tank here. Right, last one should be Weedle. Yep. Weedle! One of my favorite Pokemon. Well, one of my light Pokemon because it evolves into my favorite Pokemon. Which is, of course, the amazing Kakuna. No, I'm kidding. It's a uh, beach. I'm really getting um critical hit hacks here. That's two criticals in a row. Good. Go now I feel like how. Now I know how my opponents feel when Jeff was on the scene, back in the last Let's Play. You can catch Pokemon if you don't have six with you. If you catch one, it'll go to your box automatically. Wow, you're pretty tough. Can I get your phone number? I just got a phone number of some kid. Ding ding. Actually, I'm going to, because there's another guy we can get the phone number of, and I'm going to get his as well. So, be right back. Okay, folks, we are back. Sorry, I just got, uh, I just got youngster Joey's number. And, ba yeah, so we can take on the first trainer we ever fought, apart from Prick, and we can just rematch him whenever he wants a rematch. Okay, so... Now this this has happened quite a lot when I had to go back to get Joey's number. I got bloody it's it's just like I don't know a Gen Five encounter rate or something. Really irritating at times. Um, I got critical hit a few times. Had to heal up Seth because Seth wasn't in very good shape. He only had like I think five tackles left. Anyway, we uh, carry on a again. See. God! <laughs> Memories of the Pokemon Lab all over again. Oh, and Victory Road. <laughs> Thank God we won't have to go back to go to Victory Road again. <laughs> Please. So yeah, Seth leveled up uh, to level 11. Uh, still no other move at the moment, only we've got Smokescreen, um, uh, Tackle, and Leer. At this moment in time, we haven't really got any other big move yet. 
That's yet. Anyway, folks, welcome. Welcome to Violet City, the first city. Kicking ass. I'm sorry, you can't say no to this music. Right. That's just guy talking about trading, because this guy uh, wants a bell sprout. Uh, and if you give him a bell sprout, he will trade an onyx with you. Which in this game is very good. Onyxes are great in this game because they evolve because they can evolve in a Steelix, a gym. Don't feel ready for that yet. Might need to do a little bit of off-screen off training for that. Now we're gonna go up here. Alright, let's go here. There's this fat guy. What's up? Well, hey, I was going to snap that tree my straight arm punch, but I couldn't. I'm a failure. What tree? Oh, that tree. Ew, it's moving. You sick tree. Go and get a forest room. Ugh. Anyway, there's nothing really we can do apart from level up here. So, uh, yeah, that's, the, that's, I guess, the end of this part before we take on uh, the gym. So I will see you later for the next part of Pokemon Gr uh, Gold. I need to say Pokemon Green there. See you then.